Wifley Ura, recognized by many for his diverse roles in the entertainment industry, has left a lasting impression on audiences. Among his legendary works, one stands out as defining his career. Now, we ask you, what is your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this classic actor? We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Stay tuned as we delve into some funny, shocking, and sad facts about his life. Keep watching this video for more insights. Wesley Yura, a Louisiana-born actor, grew up in a supportive family that encouraged his love for performing. He found inspiration in the entertainment industry during his childhood and was influenced by various experiences. Landing a role in the popular TV series Land of the Lost in the 1970s marked a turning point in his career. His portrayal of the character Will Marshall earned him recognition from audiences. Throughout his career, he took on diverse roles, showcasing his versatility and skill as an actor. His early experiences played a crucial role in shaping his successful career path. He continues to be respected in the industry. Wesley Ura, known for his role as Will Marshall in the television series Land of the Lost, played a significant role in the show beyond acting. He not only portrayed the character, but also performed both the opening and closing theme songs. Additionally, he took on the task of revising the number for the third season. In an attempt to create a gimmick, Wesley Ura decided to be billed simply as Wesley in the credits of Land of the Lost in 1974. However, this strategy did not yield the desired results and is something he regrets to this day. During his time on the show, he found himself entangled in a real-life sibling rivalry with co-star Kathy Coleman, who played Holly Marshall. Both actors competed for screen time, each vying to upstage the other. Surprisingly, this dynamic continued even after the show concluded, evident in their joint interviews. The Land of the Lost experience was more than just acting for Wesley Ura. His involvement extended to contributing to the show's music and dealing with the challenges of on-set relationships. These aspects added layers to his journey within the Land of the Lost. Wesley Ura, best known for his role as Will Marshall in Land of the Lost, made a lasting impact with his performances. He showcased his versatility and talent by taking on various roles throughout his career. In some episodes, he even sang songs summarizing the lessons learned. In 1970, there were plans for him to take over Keith Partridge's role in The Partridge Family, but those plans changed when the show ended after David Cassidy's departure. From 1974 to 1981, he portrayed Mike Horton on Days of Our Lives, navigating the complexities of daytime drama. Whether exploring the mysteries of a prehistoric world or delving into the challenges of daytime TV, he always left a memorable impression on viewers. Yura's ability to immerse himself in diverse characters captivated audiences across different shows and genres. His performances continue to be celebrated by fans, both old and new, as he brought depth and authenticity to each role. His impact on the entertainment industry remains noteworthy, and the characters he brought to life continue to be appreciated. Wesley Ura's work stands as a testament to his talent and versatility on screen. Initially, he was called Wesley because his manager suggested it. Later, they added his full name to the credits, which he felt embarrassed about, but he still got recognized for his work. He got a Golden Palm Star on the Palm Springs Walk of Star in 2007. Besides playing Will Marshall in Land of the Lost, he was also on the soap opera Days of Our Lives from 1974 to 1981. What's interesting is that he was on both days and Land of the Lost at the same time. These achievements show how talented he is and how much he's appreciated by viewers. This text was, he, known for his role as Will Marshall in Land of the Lost, connected with the show's creator, Sid Croft, through a mutual friend. The two hit it off well. For the role, he auditioned alongside other actors to form the TV family. His last name is pronounced your... He frequently appears on Croft's Instagram series, Sundays with Sid, interacting with fans during live streams. This text was, Wesley Ura, known for his role as Will Marshall in Land of the Lost, shares a playful anecdote about being top billed alongside co-star Kathy Coleman in her 2017 autobiography, Run, Holly, Run. Ura's stage career includes notable performances in West Side Story as Action of the Jets and Joseph, and the amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat in the title role. He credits much of his success as an actor to his co-star Francis Reed from Days of Our Lives, who became a mentor to him when he was 23. Their superb relationship lasted for 36 years until Reed's passing in 2010, where Eura served as a pallbearer at her funeral. 
ABC wanted him to play Gopher on the Love Boat in 1977, but NBC didn't let him because of his Days of Our Lives contract. So he couldn't take the role, but he didn't give up. He kept trying to act on different shows. Besides acting on TV, he also wrote and produced stuff showing how talented he was. He showed up on other TV shows too, doing different roles and jobs. All through his career, he showed he could do many things well and worked hard at it. Even when things got tough, he didn't give up and kept going after what he loved. Today, people remember him for his work on TV and in the arts. His story is inspiring for actors and creators, teaching them to persevere no matter the obstacles they face. Wesley Ura's journey serves as a reminder that determination and passion can lead to success in the entertainment industry and beyond. Wesley Ura, a familiar face on TV, faced a sad event in his personal life. He lost his partner, Richard Chamberlain, to AIDS, which deeply affected him and highlighted the difficulties the LGBTQ community faced back then. He gained fame for his role as Will Marshall and Land of the Lost, a popular sci-fi series from the 1970s. Apart from acting, he wrote many children's books, showing his many talents. He also supported LGBTQ rights, using his fame to help raise awareness and support for the community. Throughout his career, he experienced both highs and lows, leaving a lasting mark on the entertainment world and beyond. A lesser-known fact about Wesley Yura is that he experienced a heartbreaking tragedy early in his life when he lost his sister to a sudden illness. This event deeply impacted him and shaped his perspective on life, influencing his choices and career path. Wesley Yura, known for his roles in popular TV shows like Land of the Lost and Days of Our Lives, faced personal challenges beyond the spotlight. Despite his success in the entertainment industry, the loss of his sister remained a significant and poignant part of his life story. Beyond his professional achievements, Wesley Ura's journey is a reminder of the human experiences that shape us, transcending the roles we play on screen. His resilience in the face of personal tragedy serves as a testament to the depth of the human spirit. In 1978, something really sad happened when his brother died in a terrible plane crash. This made him very sad and changed him a lot, but he didn't give up. He kept on acting in movies and TV shows like Land of the Lost and Days of Our Lives, which people really liked. Besides acting, he also started writing and making movies, showing he could do different things and loved telling stories. Doing this helped him feel better and gave him a reason to keep going when things were tough. He showed that even when life is really hard, you can still keep going and do great things if you don't give up. His story reminds us that even when things are really bad, we can still find hope and keep chasing our dreams. It's a story about being strong when bad things happen, and it shows that if you keep trying, you can make good things happen too.